My name is Deborah Viveris. Six years ago, I made a decision to leave the banking industry to pursue a career in real estate. My friends and family thought I was nuts, but I was determined to succeed. I put my nose to the grindstone, paid my dues, and showed hustle who's boss. I'm currently the managing broker and owner of a cutting-edge real estate team destined for greatness. You're invited to follow along as we take over the market. This is our journey. This is our family. This is Milestone Realty. on my way I'm gonna stop at the tile store I believe they open at 9 I'm gonna grab some samples and then I'll be over there it's 923 so I'll probably be there I would say around oh like 10 o'clock all right, um, all right. I may not be here but I'm gonna try to uh, now you, you're coming with your film crew right just my one guy yeah okay all right cool okay all right all right, sunshine. Keep that smile on. <laughs> you can tell I'm too happy for him. Yeah, it works. Of course. I mean, I don't really like the look of them, but they keep my feet warm. They kind of look like astronaut boots, if you ask me. They really do, don't they? Yeah, I don't know about astronaut boots, but... No, they look like astronaut boots. They're just comfortable. I'd say more like moccasins. I know you said that you like your uh, Ugg slippers. I do love my Ugg slippers. I don't have Ugg slippers. Uh, I they... love that bougie like you are. <laughs> extra, go. Extra. extra. This guy's extra over here. He's got his Ugg slippers. Excuse me. I would not pay $100 for Ugg slippers walking around the house. Put your feet in them, you would? No. Put on, put on my, my cheap $1 socks. Does the job. <laughs> okay? Does the job. Oh, remind me, when we go to the tile shop, if they have a little... Um, Booklet on stains for the wood floor. You know my memory sucks, right? Oh, great. Mine does too. You're supposed to remind me to remind me. Who's going to remind me? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> um, great. All right, I'll remember that. Tile. The blind leading the blind, girl. The blind leading the blind, great. For the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to grow in stone for you. For the record, lab on me going all the way. For the record. things that you do for me, Raymond. This is a little like breakfast area here. Get the coffee, the wine. Hmm, okay. A little of that here with a little pocket door. Uh, perfect. Voila. Say hi. Yeah, make sure you don't tell me when you mm -hmm. But what they don't realize is a lot of the behind the scenes 
of what goes on. Um, I do a lot of design work for some of my builders. So I'm going to the granite shop, picking up samples, going to go get tile, which I don't have to do that as a realtor, but I think that's what makes me different. I'm trying to differentiate myself from a lot of other realtors and brokers out there. And I offer these design services for my builders because they don't have time to be picking out pink colors and granite. They just want to build. So what I love about real estate is that every single day is a different day. It's not a nine to five job. If you get into real estate because you're thinking you're gonna have more time and you're gonna work less, wrong, 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 wrong. You're not gonna work nine to five. You're not gonna work 40 hours. If you really wanna make it in this business, you've gotta work every single day. No days off, we're here to service our clients. So if they call at 7 p.m. on a Sunday, you gotta pick up the phone. Because if you're not, you're not providing your customer with good customer service. subdivision here in Cranston. I do these so that we can get area brokers to the new subdivision, um, announce it to the public, really create a buzz of the new project, trying to get people in through the doors. I did this at my last project in Swansea. We had about 65 to 75 people come through. Um, it was a great success. It was there for, I would say, a year and a half and um, I sold out the whole neighborhood in three months. And then this project here, um, it was on with another realtor for a year. I've had the project for a month and I already have one under agreement. Is it raining? It's raining. I move like that. I'm dodging. Thank you, sir. Yes, yeah, so the Oh, the main reason we do events like this is we want to generate some buzz. We want to get, hopefully get some of the uh, the realtors and brokers involved, get them excited about it. You know, it, it has a little bit more spiel to it. You have some food, some drink. Uh, just give them a reason to get out and to come actually see the property. Um, and it's a social event also, so I mean, you have fun while you're doing it. Hopefully you showcase the product in its best light. Hopefully you get the numbers in there, uh, as opposed to just holding a regular open house. I mean, that's, that's the gist behind it. I can hear music roll louder Top going down while we're riding Nothing like us, babe We be glorious Looking real pretty like Kylie We bring commotion, no hiding No one like us, babe We are glorious So bang on the door Step to the floor Stir it up now Right till the morning comes We're gonna bang 